Hi Virgo. So I'm doing a love reading for the Venus retrograde cycle that we're going to be having. So let's do a relationship reading to see how this is going to be affecting you guys. Okay, so the first card is your relationship dynamics right now. Hmm. Okay, so a lot of Virgos, your relationship can feel like it's missing something. Uh, there can be a longing happening in your relationship dynamic right now where um, there people are not satisfied with something. Um, so let's figure out a little bit more about what's happening with your relationship, Virgo. Let's put a card. Let's pull a card out that has to do with how you feel about the relationship at this point. Mm. So the Hermit card reverse. So a lot of Virgos right now may be coming out of a situation where they were more closed in or more to themselves. And there, you may feel like now you may want to come out more and uh, maybe share more also too with your partner about your dissatisfaction or things that are not making you really happy. So let's check out your partner's um, viewpoint on everything happening too in the relationship. Mm. Okay, so it seems to me like your partner... Um, is also tired of either fighting, um, tired of, um, always trying to battle or always trying to, um, maybe, um, it's, it seems to me like you and your partner, probably there's been some quarrels. Maybe there's been, your partner has been going through other struggles as well. Maybe you could have been, um, a reason why. Uh, it just seems to me like your partner felt like they were struggling with something. Maybe that it seems like a letting out. So maybe you two are all are both um, struggling with something in personal because it's it's uh, the cards are reversed. So I can I I feel like you both have something that you are both work dealing with, and this may deal with this may be also why there's a dissatisfaction in the relationship between the two of you right now. So this may be a good time with the Venus retrograde that both of you may just, you know, um, discuss what's going on or situations may happen where you guys express what is happening. So let's check out the fourth card, the outcome for the two of you guys. All right. So the outcome, which is the truth of the situation. Mm, King of Cups. Okay. So this lets me know that maybe the there has been some built up emotions. Um, maybe there has been some bitterness um, in this relationship uh, about certain things. Maybe the expectations of one another were really high. Um, that there's some dissatisfaction. What it seems to me uh, is that because this is happening in your 10th house, you may not feel like you are in charge of your world anymore, that you are the person that you uh, thought yourself to be. You may be feeling like you're a new person um, and maybe you failed at something before and maybe you need to um, work at something also. Um Maybe you and your partner need some time. Mm, it seems like that too. If you can get some time away to kind of work out the emotions to understand what's happening, that might be a really good thing. And this could have also been affecting like the way that you're you're you are maybe at work and other things. So this may be something that you guys want to look into <laughs> for the retrograde uh, cycle. So I uh, hope you guys like the reading, Virgo, because the best thing about your reading is that you guys can be um, introspective and the Venus retrograde allows you that time to go within yourself and really work out what's going on so you can figure out what you really want, you know? So if you enjoyed the reading, uh, you can contact me or you can check out my website, akilaastrology.com, where you can book your reading, your tarot reading with me or an astrology reading. And um, you can check out all my social medias. So thanks, guys, and enjoy your Venus retrograde. Bye.